Yo, what's up everybody? How's it going? Today we're playing Legends of Dota, which is of course made by Ash47. And we're doing a themed Legends of Dota match today, where everybody had to pick a holiday and then build their hero according to that holiday. I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's get right into it. Friends, we got ourselves Halloween! I didn't do a Halloween episode this year. And uh, I usually like doing a Legends of Dota Halloween game, but I forgot. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't want to just skip it. So what we're doing today is everybody is a holiday, but I am Halloween! What is everybody else? Everybody go ahead and put your holidays into the chat. So the rule was that you needed to be a holiday. It doesn't mean necessarily that you had to be a specific holiday. You could be any holiday that you wanted to. It's entirely up to you, whatever you think is funny or interesting or, I don't know, is regionally relevant or whatnot, right? Like, it's up to you, basically. But I went with Halloween! <laughs> okay, I think I've made the joke. Anyways, um, let's grab ourselves this and uh, let's all grab this, this right here. And maybe a ward, we probably need one of those. And then maybe some some of these things. And then make our way into the lane. Actually, I'll just get I'll just get more more tangle. More tangle. Uh we're playing Wraith King. Uh, but of course we are playing Halloween King. Uh specifically, I've got Wraith Fire Blast. We throw a skull at somebody. That makes sense, right? Ray's dead! Now you might say, Bomby, why aren't you just playing with the skeletons the Wraith King already has? Good question. Couldn't select them. Don't know why. <laughs> They're just missing. Can't click on them. So unfortunately, as much as I wanted to, it's not really an option. <laughs> so uh, I went with Raise Dead instead. Which is the ability of the neutral creep that summons skeletons. Uh, hey, it's still skeletons. It's still something, right? So we got the Raise Dead. It's actually not that bad of an ability. It's, it's, it's pretty okay. We've got Phantom's Embrace. It's a spooky ghost that gives you a hug. Uh, we've got Parting Shot. I'm just gonna kick your soul out of your body. I mean, that seems kind of Halloween-y. I don't know. It's just an interesting ability. We don't get to use it that much. And then, uh, finally, we've got our Ultimates. Reincarnation. I mostly took Reincarnation for the Aghanims. Turns everybody into a ghost. I think that's, that's fitting, right? Um, so, I like it for that. And then we also have uh, Death Prophet's Exorcism, which is, of course, that's just fucking ghosts. I mean, that's fine, I think. Hello, we've got some skeletons. And you know what's nice about the skeletons? They're actually quite a lot of damage. Like, they, they're genuinely not that bad. Because <laughs> they also have an aura that increases our, all of our damage output. And, uh, I mean, well, like, our attack damage, not all of our damage output. Like, it increases the attack damage of nearby units by three. Uh, and that's pretty neat. Cause look at that, like we actually have like quite a lot of skeletons. So it's quite a lot of damage. Although it makes it hard to last it, but we can push with that, I guess. Hello there. I will hit you. I will regret hitting you. Oh no. I am dead. Oh, I'm a ghost! A dead ghost. Okay, that's fine. Sorry, I dove too deep. But I don't know, I don't know what to do with my skeletons to be honest. Um, being a little bit always, overly uh, ambitious, I suppose. I'm gonna grab myself an early Hand of Midas, so we've got uh, some additional income. Right, we want Hand of Midas, we want Octarine Core, we're pretty much entirely a caster, so wanna lean into that. Hello, come in. Our attack damage is really high right now. Like, 9 extra may not seem like that much, but during the early game, that's a lot. That's really nice. Now, I don't know if I can actually skill this. <laughs> this ability might just not work in its entirety. Maybe if we get our Aghanim Scepter, it will unlock. Uh, that could be, but it could also not be. I don't know. That's all right. If it doesn't work, then that's fine too, because we got a bunch of other nice abilities, right? Okay, let's get ourselves our skeletons and uh, take down some of these jungle camps. Very nice. Very good. Pick up this. Pretty happy right now. Um, I've been uploading videos to the Magic Channel, and um, they're doing well. 
like I've not been promoting them here, right? Like I've not been linking the shit. And like the first one, because you know, I think it's reasonable to do it once. But other than that, I've just been uploading to the channel and the videos still do quite, quite well. Um not, you know, legends not sorry, not legends of the stories of Dota levels of well, but you know, they also not as big uh, in production. So I think that's totally fine. We are good. We're aiming for a bit more sustainability over there. Stories of Dota um, was good, but obviously not super sustainable because it was just kind of too much. It's too difficult. Okay. Hello there. Ghosts! <laughs> Look at that. This is, this is a... This is some Halloween themed stuff, isn't it? Oh no, I don't like that. Okay. I would like you to attack my skeletons instead. Um, oh, okay. Alright, we're leaving then. It's quite a lot of damage there, isn't it? Have to be a bit careful. I'll level up the reincarnation even though uh, I can't use it right now. Don't have enough mana. Now I have enough mana. Take this. Thanks for the money. Uh, we want to get ourselves some boots. Boots are always good. But now that we have our Hand of Midas, we're going to be guaranteed to at, le had, at least have like a, a nice baseline level of farm here, which is good. Anyways, you are... Uh, what was it? Valentine's Day, right? And Flair is New Year's with lots of explosions. Not sure why there's a dragon. So like maybe Ch Chinese New Year's? Are there dragons there? Honestly, I don't know anything. I'm very ignorant of things. <laughs> Please, I hope I'm not offending anybody if I get something wrong. <clears throat> okay. Oh, 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 oh. Come here. I got a hit him. Get absolutely wrecked. Let's get the skeletons out. Oh, wait, the skeletons. <laughs> just... Well, that wasn't great. <laughs> he just fucking died. <laughs> it's not the best. Um, not the best ultimate I've ever seen right there. Okay, I am here. I'm getting ganked, which I'm not particularly happy about. Um, here's a stun for you. And of Midas on this guy. A ghost to block any potential spells. Some more skeletons. I am still alive. I am hanging in there. Okay, there's a stun. Here's another stun. Oh no! That does damage! <laughs> oh, I wasn't ready for that. Yeah, no, that does do damage. That does do damage. It's not even that bad, right? Like, it's actually a somewhat significant amount. 450! That's actually really high! I thought that was like a 300 damage ability. It's the year of the dragon. Ah, okay. Well, look at that. Very nice. I like these kind of open-ended themes because they, they give people a chance to, like, show me things that I don't know about. Which I'm always happy about. Oh. Alright, kick him out of here, I guess. Oh, bring him back. Okay, there we go. I'm not sure what this is. Is this... Kicking people. Bringing them back. This a separation anxiety a holiday. <laughs> I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I'm, it probably makes sense, but I... Bad kids on San, Saint Nicholas Day. Oh, you're... You're one of those weird, old European holidays. <laughs> which just exists to scare children. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. I'm glad. Uh, I am indeed scared. Okay. Come here. Well, we're going to push a little bit with our skeletons. And uh, we need Aghanim Scepter and we need Octarine Core. Those are kind of like our two items we're looking for. Uh, we're mostly a caster, right? So... I don't, I don't think we care much about getting attack damage. But it would be nice to have a little bit of attack speed because with Octarine Core, of course... Sorry, with Aghanim Scepter, we can use the Exorcism. Um, which is nice. Yeah, let's just get started on this. 
I also have a ward. I should probably use it at some point. Honestly, nine damage on creeps is genuinely a significant amount. It's really good. It's really good. Hello, I am Bounty Hunter, and I am telling you that you should leave a like on the video, or else I will steal all of your lunch money. Better be careful. I'm watching you. Okay. Take this. Thank you very much. Run, run, run. I am taking some damage. Like, this isn't enough to kill me. This might be. Alright, you've got a silence on you. Nice. We'll take it. What is the Earth Spirit? I'm curious. Earth Day. <laughs> I guess that's all today. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, cool. <laughs> Level up you. Here's our Aghanim Scepter. Very nice. Very good. I'm just going to slap this ward down somewhere. I think at this point, I'm just, I'm carrying, a, carrying it with me for no good reason. So, um, somewhere is better than in my inventory, right? Literally anything rather than what we're currently doing. Okay. Oh, it did unlock. Huh. Get potting shot it. Doesn't, doesn't really help that much, but, you know, we did it. Okay, I'm just standing here. I don't have enough mana as my main issue. But I, I can throw out one of these. Level up the reincarnation a bit. I don't want to die. If I can avoid it, that would be great. I don't mind dying either. Fine with either one, really. You may kill me, but you may also not. I'm somewhat impartial to death at the moment. Let's grab ourselves our Octarine Core. Still such a shame that this doesn't... Wait, why is this not being picked up? This is mine, right? Well, the one from earlier wasn't mine. Trusty Shovel is always fun. Oh, hey, we got a little buddy. Got a little friend. Alright, Phantom's Embrace. Take down all of these. But yeah, I don't know, it's just... I'm I'm happy that, you know, the new channel is doing, doing fine. And I have a lot of ideas for videos, I have a lot of things I want to do. I'm having some, some problems kind of getting into the groove of things a little bit. Okay. I mean, it's not enough, is it? Here. <laughs> I'm just gonna punch the soul out of your body. Eating self. Why not? So that's still a bit of a problem. But I mean, that's that's just a me problem, right? I don't know. Sometimes things are a bit difficult. But I try. It's really all I can do at the end of the day, right? Extra stun duration, hell yeah. It's actually really nice. A whole second? It's a very significant amount. Okay. That's a kill. We throw one of these. I am out of mana. But who knows? Maybe this is fine. Very good. This is why we need the Octarine Core. That fixes our mana problems. We're pretty close to it, so... Everything is about to be fine. Oh, a mango! Okay, why not? <laughs> that helps too. That's some good mana. Grab this. Okay, there's the situation. Uh, I think I'm just gonna run your slam exorcism. I do not. No, I do have a reincarnation right now. But not gonna use any other abilities until I have enough mana for everything. So far, we're good. 
Just ghosting people. <laughs> this is not enough to kill right now. There we go. Ah, if I die, my... Yeah, that makes sense. The dot would reset. Okay. That's a kill. I will... Spook you. Ooh. Get spooked. And I think I'm just stunning you, right? I mean... Sticking around a bit longer, aren't we? Here's the silence. Oh, wait! You didn't finish the kill? <laughs> well, that's not good. Oh, no! New Year's is here! <laughs> I have no defense against New Year's. Man. Creeps up on you, doesn't it? Doesn't it? That's just lore accurate New Year's. What are we getting? Hmm. I mean, I have my items. I don't really need anything else. Just get a dig and just dig in people. <laughs> my shard? Does my shard do anything? Doesn't have a mana cost? Well, I don't... I'm not that worried about mana anymore. Like, I know in that specific moment we were running low on mana, but that's because we were low on mana going into the fight. But now... I should be fine. Like, now we should be okay. I'm just gonna get a day again. This is mostly scary for my teammates, but... <laughs> it is still happening. <laughs> Alright. Mmm, an arcane rune. Hello. That's a kill. Here, kick you out of your bar. <laughs> that is so sick. I love it. Uh, who's next? Here's a silence for you. Oh, friends. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> well, that didn't go great, did it? Well, it went, for, it was, it went great for me, I guess. Taking time. Got him. Took him all down. No problems inside. Got our Dagon maxed out now. Yeah, it turns out Exorcism is an incredibly dangerous ability that you need to be careful. Careful with. Here's a ghost. Here's a school. Here's a blast of energy. <laughs> Okay, again, that last one might not be thematically quite quite perfect, but that's alright. Have another ghost. Okay, we're getting nuked. Do you want a ghost? Oh, Sunder. Okay, that's fine, kill me. Because now we just come back, we spam this button. Is this? I will shoot the ghost out of your body. There we go. This will explode in a second for 450 damage. Which is truly outrageous if you ask me. Okay, can we kill this? <laughs> Dagon. <laughs> of course we can kill it. Of course we can. Alright, come on. Oh, so close, but... Down he goes. Down he goes. I've got a little bit of money. Just a tad. Just get a Radiance, maybe? Why not? It's actually kind of a classic Wraith King item. Not so much these days anymore, but for a long time. For a long time. Radiance, Wraith King. Pretty popular. And I think it makes sense. Because he's just so tanky. You can stay in fights forever. So you might as well just burn people constantly. Of course, it didn't work well with his crit. But a crit didn't used to be as good as it is today. Sell this. Ooh, our tier 1 tower is still alive. 
That's actually kind of impressive. We've got our Dagon. I'm leaning towards E-Blade. Mostly just for the cast range. Yeah. That makes sense to me. Sell the Hand of Midas. We're level 30. We don't need it anymore. Also, Dagon E-Blade is a classic. Classic. So, where's everybody? I'm ready to throw skulls at people. There's an Ember Spirit over here. I think I'm just going to activate my ultimate and then start pushing. Look, I don't know where they are, but I think we can find them. I think they'll find themselves. Alright. <laughs> You're silenced. Come on! Good. We got there. Very nice. Taking some damage from over here. I think I care. <laughs> think I'm afraid of your shenanigans? I will gladly sacrifice myself to Dagon you. Wait, did you block that damage? If you did, that's pretty sick. Alright, we're just gonna hold our position. Stand our ground. Keep fighting. I'm out of mana. Okay, there we go. Well, maybe we do want the Aghanim's shard. It doesn't come at great cost, and uh, I do like the idea of not having to worry about mana. Because uh, in a fight this long, there is still a chance of me running out, as we just saw. There we go. <laughs> I don't think we can get there. Let's play it careful. Don't want to die. Your king moves of his own accord. Grab these and then... The Let's check what we got in the box. Kind of nothing. Whisper of the Dread. That seems appropriate. Any more items? Honestly, just the heart seems good. More survivability is all we need. We can rely entirely on exorcism for damage. It's such a good ability. Love is the way. Hmm, maybe. Hmm. <clears throat> Yeah. That's alright. Although, unfortunately, it does mean we don't have our... We don't have our exorcism anymore. That heal didn't come. Ah... Well, I mean, I'm sure it did connect, but it wasn't quite as effective as I wanted it to be. I know I haven't been using my skeletons, but it feels a bit rude to summon the skeletons just so that they immediately die to AoE. <laughs> they only have 250 life, you know, <laughs> they're not that good. <laughs> and we can't level them up, they level up passively. Um, and I don't even think that works properly, right? I don't think you can actually... Uh, level up these skeletons if you are a hero. <clears throat> oh, I'm dead for a while. Hmm. All right. Uh, but yeah, anyways, like I'm, I'm happy about the new YouTube channel doing well. So we've got three videos on there right now. One got 11,000 views, one got 5,000 views. And the first one has a much higher view count because that's the one where I like, kind of told you about it here. And then a lot of you went over there, clicked on the video and didn't actually watch it. <laughs> that's okay. Um, and then one that I just uploaded. No promo, no nothing. 
got a casual 5,000 views. And then the one we uploaded yesterday, it's at 3,000 already. And it's just kind of continuing to grind up there. It's getting yeah, 150 views an hour right now. And right now is not a good time. Because like a lot of magic content, right? Like is or magic audience is North American uh, and European. And so like currently when I'm recording this, which is around 4 p.m. my time, isn't exactly the best time for those people to watch because people in North America are asleep and people in Europe are at work. Um, so I think there's a good chance that continues going up there. And I'm pretty happy about that. Nice skewer. Alright, I'm coming. Just keep kicking the guy. Alright, here's a silence for you anyways. Oh, I might be dead. Hmm, not quite. I certainly took a lot of damage. The question now is, is it a good idea to come in to help? Probably not. Seems to me like I should just go back, heal up, and see if we can find a better opportunity. <clears throat> Our opponents retreated? A little bit. A little bit. I'm level 37. <laughs> Oh, well, that was a sharp increase, wasn't it? Well, you are presumably dead. Yeah, the death ball matter. I mean, that's just how Valve wants these types of games to work, though. It's not how Deadlock works. I just assume that anything that is in Deadlock is what Valve, like, kind of, like thinks is the ideal state for these types of games. Alright, I will kick your soul into whatever next week. <laughs> okay, we have some... I am just permastone. Yeah, no, I'm dead. I mean, I did some damage, surely, but... Ultimately, I do just die. Yeah, I just assume that anything that Valve is doing differently in Deadlock when compared to Dota is what they think is just the optimal way of doing it. I tried Bebop in Deadlock. He's very fun. Uh, I tried him. I didn't really like his gun, though. Bebop has a weird gun where you're like, you have to charge it up a little bit and then it's just this continuous beam. But you can't, like, pause shooting, because if you pause shooting, immediately you have to charge it up again. And I know there are a lot of people that enjoy Bebop, but I just couldn't really find the right rhythm with this weapon. Admittedly, that was, you know, when I started playing the game. I've slowly been exploring um, more and more of the cast. <laughs> nice. <laughs> That'll do it. That'll do it. So we're just getting disabled forever. I, they do have some heroes for that. The uh, Earth Spirit, of course, has one. That's not a stun. It's a slow. But this is a stun. One, two, three, four, five stuns and a slow. The Clockwork has a stun here. But, but that's it. That's all. But Alchemist has... <laughs> Rearm Dual Sunday. <laughs> oh, that's so silly. Yeah, let's get that heart. Maybe tanking up will help a bit. Most of the damage we take is from magic, right? So since uh, a lot of the damage that's coming at us is just magic damage. Heart is the best way to go. I'm coming, friends. It's just gonna take me a minute. 
Oh no. Are we even going in still? No. I would rather try to survive a moment longer and see if we can maybe defend. Okay, we're taking some damage, but nothing we can't handle. That's what the heart is for, after all. Damn. The disables, though. I am just getting stunned for days. Okay, we're still alive. For the moment. Nope. Wow. Yeah. And that's me down again. I mean, honestly, I'm worried that they might just have this one. Because they got so, so much disable. And their damage is a bit stronger now, too. On our side. It's a funny right click pug now, but I don't know if that's good enough. <laughs> What's the Mars up to? Alright, this was the Carnival Mars, which unfortunately means that there's not too much damage, is there? <laughs> what holiday is this Ember Spirit, anyway? Okay, let me see if I can figure it out. Trees? Fire? I guess more fire, oil, lanterns type thing? More fire, more fire, and more trees, more nature. The solstice? Maybe? Guy Fox Knight. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I kind of liked my answer more. <laughs> oh, man. Definitely some curious choices here. I guess that's what happens if you let people pick themselves, you know? <clears throat> Should I guess the others too? Well, we already looked at Straka. Queen of Pain. Queen of Pain is Valentine's Day. I know that. Uh, Pugna. Randomness. Random, random, random. A little green goblin. Didn't somebody say St. Patrick's Day earlier? Like a leprechaun. Aren't leprechauns associ associated with luck? So yeah, I, I would guess St. Patrick's Day on that. This is the carnival, we know that. We figured out um, Chinese New Year. This right is... <laughs> we already just looked at that. This is New Year's, I believe. Earth Day and Alchemist. Acid Spray, Sunder, Rearm and Duel. Honestly, I have no idea. Christmas gifting. You gift damage. My guy, I don't know if you're gifting <laughs> much damage. Are you gifting damage to yourself? I don't know if that counts. I don't know if you can gift yourself damage. <laughs> Guess that's some semblance of a presence. Hey, we're taking somebody. Okay. We threw a stun. That's good. Got another stun. Nice. Very good. Hey, Ahmad uh, Najjar. Thanks for the Twitch Prime. Appreciate it. Also, I hope I pronounced that somewhat accurately. Probably didn't. You know, I find names to be really interesting and really difficult. <clears throat> There's so many different ways. It was close. Oh, look at me. Look at me. It was close. Oh, I'm happy with close. Feel free to correct me, though. 
Uh, it's obviously Amazon Corporate Day. I buy myself the best presents. <laughs> I love it when other people get me presents. I love it. I cherish them very much. Every tiny thing. Doesn't have to be anything big. <laughs> Keep your thoughts to yourself. Oh no. Oh, why did I come here? Oh, this is just, it's just Stun City. Oh, I just, I cannot, I cannot do anything. Oh dear, I am trying to run. I am dead, I am dead. Damn, that's crazy, well, I mean, if I'm dead, I might as well. I have re well, not reincarnation, I have buyback. So I can come back if I want to. I can come back. This Jakiro is really scary. It's just surprising to me, because I don't think this Jakiro actually has that much. But it's just a matter of, you know, like having the double trouble, assassinate, and then a million other stuns. Yeah, my respawn time is kind of long, but it's because I'm level 42. <laughs> the respawns keep going up. It just keep getting longer. It's, uh, it's actually kind of a problem if you go past level 30 because your respawns start um, just being awful. <clears throat> I'm not going to buy back, I think. Good 40 seconds. You know, it's an interesting thing as well, like in Deadlock. The respawn times are much shorter. I mean, I feel like I should just make like a detailed breakdown of Deadlock versus Dota, but oh, it's just so much work, you know? It's so much work, and who would even care? Who would even give a shit? I'm not saying that because I want you guys to go into the YouTube comments and be like, Bowie, it is me. I give a shit. Like, I know you give a shit. But, like, I don't actually think that many people would give a shit. Hello there. All right, I need to keep this guy silenced. That's fine. I, I genuinely do not mind if we're both silenced. That is fine. Look, this guy is just the scariest hero they've got. Okay. Wait, no, you kicked him too far. <laughs> you kicked him too far. <laughs> How are we gonna get him now? Alright, we've got a silence. More silence. More stuns. More silence. Oh no, oh come on, we can do this! Okay, we got him. No, the thunder! Don't worry, we got all day. <laughs> There's a silence. Get him in there! Do it! Yes. It's fine. We did it. <laughs> it took a little while. <laughs> But Krampus came in and stole that Jakiro. 
Good job, Krampus. I mean, he's even a little dead. <laughs> yeah, my damage output is not really all that high, is it? I think we need to itemize entirely differently. Kind of like our build because it's funny. But you know, it's not actually good. Okay then, let's get rid of some of our garbage. I'm gonna pick up a blood thorn. And I think I'm gonna go for Saint and Yasha. And... Is Eternal Shroud any good? Hmm. It's okay. I'm not like enthusiastic about it though. I mean, BKB is the obvious choice. Yeah, refresher. I'm kind of down for a refresher, to be honest. That seems fine. Uh, we can buy a moon shard, but I don't really want to buy a moon shard right now because I want to keep buyback. Okay, so we've got deaths on both sides. It might be best to wait. Although. I actually feel like maybe they benefit more from the alchemist than we benefit from the moss. So there's always that argument that maybe we should just go for it. It is a little bit rude, but also maybe a little bit true. Mindbreaker's good. Aviana's feather. This is a good one. I kind of like that because we are dying very slowly. So maybe this is actually going to be somewhat noteworthy damage. Maybe. Not convinced, but maybe. Alright, we have some skeletons. They are dead. <laughs> they tried their best, okay? Is that a BKB? Ooh. Okay, we've got the ghosts, but like honestly, I'm just dead. So there goes exorcism. Alright. There's a stun on this guy. That should be a kill on Jakiro, and that's a team wipe. And we lost nobody. You know, I feel like sometimes I should just stop doing my stupid shit and just buy the items I know are better. Because, <laughs> like, this item set was obviously 10 times more effective. And I'm not trying to take credit away from my team. I think they played very well. But also, my item set made, made a big difference for me, right? All right, we got him. We did it. Let's go. So what did we learn today, kids? We learned the carnival is better than New Year's. I guess. I don't know. I, I guess. <laughs> I'm not sure if I agree with that, but it seems like that's what we learned. All right, then, friends. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. I definitely appreciate that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.